afternoon and welcome, welcome, welcome to another vlog. We're shooting a photo shoot for... It's a photo shoot there, Turtle Beach. Turtle Beach photo shoot. We're, 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 we're like cheering towards like... I mean, you guys saw us in the, in the intro as I was like doing the speed thing. Um, how often do you do this a week? Photo shoots. At least six, bro. You? What? How, how, <laughs> how many how many times a week do you do this? A week? Yeah. Uh, when was the last time you did a photo shoot? Didn't you just end up in like a, yeah, a I was Best in Buy? LA. Oh, I was. Weren't you? Oh yeah, I was you were for in the Best Buy. yeah in Illinois, right? Yeah. For what? Like a photo shoot? Yeah. From the photo shoot that he did. What was that? I don't know, but I saw you like on the Say oh on the newspaper, no on the uh, a magazine on the magazine. I was about to go on Instagram and hit myself up. Best <laughs> Buy, <laughs> you know. Get a sponsorship or oh shit. God. I'm already in there. We got the boy Natso here shooting all the all the fire, uh, as usual. We got a couple of lights, a couple of production people holding sheets and shit and cameras. <laughs> Nick, Nick and Hitch are on the other side shooting. Um, trivia. Yeah. Oh my god, today's been long. It's already 4 o'clock. I've been here since 8. And my day has not stopped. It won't stop. I have a 6 o'clock meeting. And then we still have to wait for the for the actual new product from Turtle Beach to get here. We're going to talk about it. We're not going to show it to you. Just know that some fire's coming out. If I do say so. Meself, mate. Right, just like that, we wrapped the entire day. I'm going to head home now. Big timer, you're going to nice head home. Little, like, spend thing. You Thank did. you. That was cool. uh, right, yeah. Just came back and now we're now yeah. we're here. See, that's, that's how you did. It. Remember when you took over my vlog that one time? Uh, I do not. I think it was multiple times actually. But do you remember what you said? Nope. Said, What's up, pussies? <laughs> <laughs> Which was very on brand for me at that time. I don't I don't say that anymore. Right. I don't call people that word anymore. We're grown, bro. Twenty nine years old, bro. Was yeah, 20, we can. We gotta put some I, respect 60, on people. 50, what was that? 20, 22, 23 with the pink shirt. Wait, did everybody leave without saying bye? Yeah, I think it's just it's just you and I, brother. Oh, well, all right. I won't no, hold you. it's just you because I'm out. I'll be back later this week. See you vlog. Everybody is finally gone. Obviously, today's the following day, and the, the it wasn't a big mess that was left here, but, man, it was such a pain. I, I, I was here at 8 yesterday, as so I mentioned yesterday's vlog. And I didn't leave until, I believe, 6... 6.45, because I caught up with my man, Brett Lautenbach. My man, Brett Lautenbach, and I caught up. I got a shipment from RX Bar. And I, uh, I opened it up earlier, and there is literally no notes as to... Who sent me this and why? Nut butter. <laughs> Nut butter, nine grams of protein, one egg white, 12 peanuts, half a date, no bullshit, no BS? Is no BS like a thing? Nut and protein spread. Oh. So this is like a, like a, like packaging stuff or this is like a, like a spread, yeah, it's like jelly almost, but it's, uh, you put it on toast or something? I don't know, I'm not a nutritious guy, obviously, as you guys can see here in many places. Two, three egg whites, six almonds, four cashews, and let me see, is there, they got uh, anything light up in this? Three egg whites, six almonds, RX bar, it's pretty good. Are they saying that they put three egg whites in this 14 peanuts, two dates, in this little tiny little bar? Wow. Wow, it's actually kind of fire. Anyway, um, today's a day that I unveil something to you guys, I think. I'm not sure yet. I've been working on a secret project behind your backs, okay? Look, I'm not, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't tell you about it. I'm sorry I kept it from you. I'm sorry I did it behind your back, but I had to. I like the theatrics, as you guys all know, but I got a new place. 
I got a new place and I'm gonna bring you guys to it today. I, I, as I was saying that, I'm like, maybe it's not, it's not ready. The place that I'm showing you is not ready. It's not finalized, it's not finished. But I wanna show you guys. So you guys can see what I've been working on behind the scenes. You guys wanna go now? Let's go. They super hooked it up. This, this are oats. I think you just add water or something. I got breakfast for a long time. Thank you, RX Bar, for sending me this and with no note. I, it did say Hector on the packaging, okay? So I'm not grabbing Maddie's stuff or Itch's stuff. Uh, it did say it was for me, so it'll be put to good use. Thank you very much. Let's go to the place now, to the secret spot, to the place where I've been. Welcome, welcome to the fishing quarters, the fish quarters, the basher's quarters, the mini Guggen headquarters. Here, we'll wait for that to calm down. So I've been sort of keeping this secret for myself for a very, very long time. I mean, obviously the people around me know about it, but I needed to find a place that was close to my house in which I can keep the boat. My neighborhood, unfortunately, doesn't allow for water vessels to be there for a prolonged period of time. Even if it's in your own driveway, don't ask me why I disagree, I'm with you. But I found this very, very cool place that I want to introduce you to. Um, it is going to be my art studio because I can't really spray paint in the hex quarters because it's such a confined space. And the amount of dust or spray paint uh, dust that flies around, all the mist, gets on top of the computers, gets on top of the screens, and it just creates this like massive, massive mess. So uh, I got super, super lucky to find a place like this that is secure, that has like everything that I need in order to create something. They even have this very cool area. In fact, let me take you back to the beginning, and it's gonna be several different videos uh, that sort of amount to something and then I'm gonna come back and then I'm gonna have this conversation with you um, We're gonna go through every single one of those videos of me coming in here seeing the preparation and it's still not done What that means is that the vlog just got a little bit more interesting with this additional project that you'll see uh, You know moving here to Texas one of my biggest plans was to you know fish on a semi-regular basis on a daily basis if time permitted uh, you know, the majority of my sort of fishing happens at, in the morning because obviously that's the time we're slowest, right? Everybody wakes up super late in esports, as you guys know, uh, and I can take any meeting from the water, right? So I figured if, if I wake up early enough and I go fish up until like 11 o'clock, I'll be back in time to continue on with my day regularly as I would any other time. Uh, so this will help facilitate that. I don't have to hear from the HOA anymore about my boat. Uh, and now I have a very, very cool place that I can share with you guys, and you guys will see magic happen. I'll tell you all the plants about it, but first let's get back, let's go back in time to see the first couple of times when I was in here and the work that we've done thus far. But there's still so much more to be done. Let's go. And uh, it's, it's 30 by, let's see, uh, 30 by 48. 30 by 48. Yeah, 30 by 48. Painting day number one has begun. Uh, we have the scaffolding here. Uh, I don't know what we're gonna add here, but I do want, I think I'm gonna have the big Guggen Squad logo here. The big Guggen Squad logo here, and then a big Bashers uh, skeleton over there. Uh, back there is, we're gonna, we're gonna have a bathroom right here. This is where we're going to have a bathroom. I mean, you could go now. Bathroom over there. Uh, here, we're going to have this entire wall, truly, is going to be filled with just like cabinetry. I don't know if I'll put a little kitchen in here because I don't really think there's a need for it. Uh, but maybe. Uh, I'm not going to get it, you know, I'm not going to say no to it, but I still haven't, you know, really thought about it. But I did want to put, this will be the bait wall. This is where all the baits are going to go. Uh, again, cabinetry and all that. Uh, the ceiling's all gonna be painted black. That's gonna be painted black. The doors are gonna be painted black. Um, and if you go up here, 
this whole wall i don't know i think i might do a texture wall of some sort and then i don't know i think uh once we get once the paint comes in and once we replace the replace these guardrails i think it'll make it easier i want to put a fridge at the end there or maybe i'll put it here because this post is on the way this little pipe is on the way so maybe i'll do it there tv there couches I don't know, still figuring out, maybe a pool table, poker table here, and then we can have poker parties here, because this place is massive, like massive. Boat, truck, art, maybe I won't even, maybe I'll do both Guggen Squad and Bashers shit over here, and then I'll just use that as a graffiti wall. I don't know, because this thing opens up and it's massive. And if I'm able to open that up, then it'd be really easy for me to just paint without fumes getting in the way. So this is gonna be, this is gonna be like a, like an artwork, uh, opportunity too because I need a, a place to create art the studio lends itself to be nice for gaming and all that stuff and I always keep that I, I love the hex quarters but when it comes to art and spray paint and all that there's so many obstacles and so many things that I'm like not allowed to do in there that kind of puts a damper on things and this is obviously going to be also storage for Guggen's you know maybe uh yeah the couch that turns into a bed Bathroom, shower. I don't know if I put a shower in here. Judith doesn't want me to put a shower in here because she thinks I'm gonna move in here as my true man cave. Because you know, obviously the the, the hex port is a man cave, but not this kind of man cave. You know what I'm saying? Um, day number three. This door is now black. How awesome does that look? Holy shit! Uh, the the ceiling is now a little bit more matte black. They've done this portion of it, which wasn't done yesterday. Uh, they started to paint the walls white. I think they're gonna give it another coat. This was just a primer. Uh, and then I think upstairs is gonna be the same thing. But overall, I am loving the way that this is turning out. I think uh, this look is very hex quarters-ish. Uh, once, time out, look at that. You see that black against, against that green? Look how good that looks. I might fuck around and spray paint that bar green or just have one single stripe of, I, I, I don't know, but I think maybe that pipe should be green. This, this pipe right here should be green to give it that, that pop look. I, I really like this. I mean, obviously, you know, I love those colors to begin with, um, but I think it'd be a good idea. Anyway, uh, the mini Guggen fish quarters is coming along nicely. Uh, oh shit, I should have told them to paint this. I want, I'm gonna want them to paint the, they did actually. Okay, it's black. I wanted the, the electrical box to be painted black as well to match like everything. Wow, I'm super hype about it. Anyway, that's day three. Day number five. I may have skipped day number four, but we are all set and done. This place looks like a completely and utterly new thing. Uh, I'm super excited about what's about to happen in here. Uh, Guggen Squad logo there, uh, Bachelor's logo there, Guggen Squad logo there, uh, Bates, 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 super, super fishy headquarters sort of stuff. Um, I think they, they may have sprayed down and tried to clean it up, so I'd appreciate that. Bathroom over there. Not that we need it, but I, I think I'm going to have to paint these because I don't like the, the wood look. I haven't decided if I'm going to do tile or metal or whatever. This is the place to do it. Anyway, I'm super psyched about the way this is coming out. I love the black ceilings. I love that this got all painted. It doesn't look, it looks, it still looks industrial without having that metal -y look, which is what I love about it. Art. Oh, I'm so psyched. I am so, I cannot tell you how happy I am to have a, to have a place like this one. So close to, to the office too. Um, anyway, it's dope that all this is done. As long as they remove the scaffolding, I'm going to go get my boat. Once I have my boat in here, I'm going to go fish. Good things are happening. Uh, anyway, that's it. Day number five or four. I don't know where I'm at. Day number 70. I'm kidding. Day number seven. We have now added the epoxy flooring, which is pretty much just a coat of plastic with these cool little flakes but apparently I can't move in yet because it takes a while for them to dry out completely um, it's kind of whack because see like those flakes I wonder how they did that I wonder if they just fucking like tossed shit out there 
and made it super cool. Um, so, as I said, there's, there's, there's still a lot of stuff to do. I'm going to add some board, wood baseboards around this thing because I don't want to see the animals and the shit like that. So far, so good, though. Nothing on my feet. I'm just gonna go get my boat and put it in here. I don't care. I mean, what's this? Dude, the biggest accident just happened. I stepped on the traps and they won't help me out, yo. No, just give me a, give me a, 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 a thing, like a, a stick or something. Dude, what, you didn't see me? No, 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 no. No, 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 I need one of these fucking two by fours. No, 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 two by four, two by four. Oh, dude, oh. Bro, if they start claw crawling on me, what if they start going up my leg? Watch out, with the, they got nails. Some of them. Oh. Okay, good. Dude, I just stepped on that. I heard, all I heard was crunch. Anyway, this is day number 17. Uh, the epoxy floors are already in. Bathroom's not in yet, but they just put, they just put some uh, flooring here, which is dope. Look at that. Ooh, fire. And that, and this incident just happened yesterday. As you guys just saw there, uh, I showed Big Timer and Embos this new place. Uh, when I tell people that I got a garage, people don't understand. They think they just think it's like a storage unit, but this is so much more than that. This is so much more than that. If at any point me and the Googans are gonna go somewhere, and a lot of I'm not gonna, well, two of them live right near here, not right near Frisco. This place is in Frisco, by the way. This is five minutes away from from the hex quarters close to 15 minutes away from a house, which means that any single time that I get up at 4 a.m. in the morning, I don't have to drive 45 minutes to the Guggen headquarters to get my boat, hitch it up, and then drive wherever. And then after I'm done fishing, drive to the, head, to the, to the Guggen headquarters, drop off my boat, and then come over here. Now, I can literally wake up at 5, be here by 5.15, be on the water by 6. Yeah, I mean, it depends on how far I travel, but you get the point. Anyway. I am super psyched and proud to present the work in progress that is the Bashers, I don't even know, the name will come eventually, I'm sure, but uh, as you guys can see, we've done a lot of work, we've done a ton, a ton of work here. In the videos that I just showed you, you guys saw that, you know, uh, 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 the idea of what we want this to look like, the bathroom and all of that, but it's a very, very big space. I mean, the boat obviously can, this, this boat can move up like three to four more feet because I can bring this extendo thing this way and I can literally park the boat all up to here. So it's, it's very, very spacious. Um, as you guys can see, it's hard, it's hard for me to give you guys a, a brand new tour, so please forgive me if I'm telling you everything twice uh, that, from what you've seen already, okay? so. The upstairs, this mezzanine is so spacious, so spacious, and they just put in the floor yesterday, um, or this thing, that's why you see it dusty, but I wanted it to look like the hex quarters, that's why you see white walls, black, uh, black ceilings, this AC is super, super powerful, um, I gotta be careful to not step back, but look at this, look at this, look at the space. Look at that space and then look at this space. That's, that table used to be in my, in my, uh, in my house. Uh, but yeah, this is what I have been working on on the side. Like every day after work, I come here and then I do the run through. And eventually what I wanna do is I wanna spend every weekend here. Like Saturday and Sunday, I'm not gonna go to work. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay away from there. And I'm gonna come here and I'm gonna create, right? I'm gonna read my laptop. So if I need to take a meeting or for work or actually like have to do some actual work, then I'll obviously bring that with and make it happen. But for the time being, again, this is just gonna be for me to come in here, paint my canvases, paint my paintings, paint these walls, and work on it. Work on this project that you guys will see in the vlog. Um, I know that I've been going super hard on the vlog lately and you guys have been seeing me on a daily basis sort of getting back into the groove of things. 
I still want to do that. I still want to keep that cadence of, of, of you know, uploading on a, on a daily basis. But, you know, there will be the time or the day that I have to skip. And if I do, I want to, you know, do something simple like a question, like a Q&A or something else. I'll figure it out. Either way, I'm super hyped about this. Um, I hope you guys are willing and able to come along on this journey with me. If you guys have any suggestions on things that I can do here, please let me know. Because I, I, you know, this is... This is mine. This is my thing. This is, this is where, this is the man cave, okay? The woman cave too. Women, my wife's allowed. I was going to say women are allowed, but my wife's allowed in here. God damn it. Um, anyway, super psyched about it. You have no idea. All these stairs are going to be replaced. Obviously, this is, this is just like the very basic, the most basic uh, sort of stairs that they give you so you can get up to the mezzanine, but they're supposed to be replaced. Um, I haven't decided on whether I'm doing steel staircases or what. Either way, it doesn't matter. Uh, this is, again, I, I can't tell you how happy I am that I was able to get this place. Uh, it, was, it was a long, drawn-out process, but I ended up with a place. Originally, I was supposed to get a place that was in the middle of all these buildings, and then this came uh, available, and I jumped at the opportunity, and, and here we are. So, super psyched about it. Like, I cannot tell you how happy I am. Uh, anyway. Thank you so much for tuning in, guys. I appreciate you guys always showing up and showing love on the video by leaving a like like you're doing right now. Do it right now. Um, and yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. If you guys enjoy the video, please remember to leave without leaving a like. Having said that, boys and girls, and with that said, I'm going to see you guys tomorrow, hopefully as usual, and as per usual, at the same. Damn.